All right, all right. It's another video of the also brands cool YouTuber, from what I can tell. And yeah. So, this video you've probably seen it in your feed already. The one last video for the end of the world. It took me a little, it took me a little bit before I found out it wasn't. It was more than a coincidence. I see everyone sort of making these videos. So I'm gonna join the the club and be one of the cool kids. The end of the world has always fascinated, you know, mankind and people for various reasons. For me, it's it's, it's base and ape. My interest in it anyway, because you know, when, when everything is coming to an end, you would like to believe that you're going to meet that end with some sort of um, flourish or maybe you'll, you'll look, you know, death right in the face as the comet or a meteor comes down and s destroys everything. Or maybe in the zombie apocalypse, you you will somehow survive and help restart the human race. Um, or maybe you're, 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 you're a realist and think that you are going to die if an apocalypse takes place, because that's pretty much what apocalypses do, is kill everyone. But I like to think that I'd be walking the streets as you know pandemonium is is happening and in my apocalypse there's a general just pandemonium happen there's an inescapable undestructible comet the size of earth or something like that so you know there's no way that you can send Bruce Willis out there to take care of the comet nothing like that but it would be a kind of a melancholy like a you have people, of course, you know, shooting each other. Uh, maybe some rape and violence in the streets. You know, Hollywood stuff. But I'd find, you know, some some girl, some woman, a woman that also has the same melancholy look. And I bring her close to me. We kind of hold each other. Kissy's not important, but it is cinematic in my little fantasy here. So we kiss, and it's not one of those passionate kisses it's just you know two lips touching and then there's a destruction in the background like a like a nuclear bomb and you know the shock wave hits and then the irradiation kind of pours out from it turning everything to dust nuclear dust now i understand you know what's a nuke going off when there's a comet in the sky that doesn't make any sense but i don't care it's my apocalypse and it's your life and I don't know how many of you would be happy right now if your life were to suddenly end. There was nothing beyond this point today. Would you be happy with how, with what you've done so far? If there was some sort of account, some aliens or whatever, or God, or oh, whatever, your, your, your deeds will somehow be known from this point, the point of your destruction. If someone were to review your life from this point all the way back to your birth, would they be happy with how you turned out? So, I don't know how many other apocalypses there are on the menu, but Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. Uh, Mary Ragnarok and Apocalypse Now.